Yo, what's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here to bring you another installation of the bodybuilding segment. This is actually day one of a straight workout segment that we're gonna be doing. So um, if you guys weren't aware, the push-up video got about 322 likes. So that's 322 push-ups that I'm going to have put in as a regular, um, as a regular regimen for me to do every two to three days. You know, I don't know how long it would take my body to recover necessarily from this, but um, we'll see basically. So you guys are embarking on this journey as I am. So there's going to be a few things that we do today. I already purchased a bodybuilding meal that I'm going to show you guys later on that um, that I learned would be conducive for me like eating after a workout. I also got me um, a couple of other things as well, but we'll get into that later on. But we're going to get into the meat and potatoes of this bodybuilding segment, the push-ups themselves. So um, now if you'll join me, let's get on the floor and let's start hammering these things out. You know what? This body transformation, I'm trying to at least see some kind of results before summertime. So you know what? I'm more than ready to get into it. You guys have pushed me this far, you know, and all of you guys have been asking, you know, Etika, where's the bodybuilding video? You know, are you slacking, bro? Well, I'm in it, man. I'm in it to win it. So before we get into it, though, let me just show you guys some stats about, um, like, we'll just measure my arms, for example, just to see what the stats are. Okay, so we're back, and um, I have measuring tape here. We're going to basically check out my arms, see just how big they are, just so we can see that there's something to measure this on, like, you know, for later on. So later on, we can see, oh, wow, he came from that many to this many. So, you know, it'll be cool to see. Now, of course, I'm going to be working mostly upper body, but I will be doing some legs as well. You guys are more than welcome to leave your comments and suggestions and things that you would like to see. By the way, please feel free. Help me out. I'm, I'm new in this. I'm just as new as some of you guys are, so, you know, let me know. But, um, okay, so looking at my arms, right? Um, my arms are about 14 inches. About 14 inches, pretty much exactly. Oh, huh, okay. You guys probably can't see, but um, 14 inches. Yeah, pretty cool. But all right, cool. So um, now that we know that, at least we'll have some kind of use, unit of measurement for later on in the series. You know, we're not going to measure them like tomorrow, but we'll at least be able to see where I came from. But um, now for the hardest part, man, I am going to hate this, but let's get into it, man. The push-up video, 320 push-ups. So I guess I'll divide those into three sets. So um, we're looking at three. Wait, right, just come over here so I can do some math. You know, I just need to be able to um, know. I'm really bad at math, so I have to get a calculator to make sure it's accurate. Divide by three. <laughs> and we're looking at 107. So we're going to be doing three sets of 107 each. And I had no real prior, like, fitness, like, experience, you know, like, at least in the next, at least in the last, like, five years. So, I mean, yeah, we're going to get into this. All right. So remember, we're looking at. Three sets of 107. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh God. Oh, I haven't even done it yet and I feel. <laughs> okay, okay, no more bullshit. We're going into this, alright? Let's do it. Okay. Let's go. All the way through. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh. 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 God. Oh, man. How am I supposed to do this? Oh, God. All right. Okay. Okay. Oh, 20. Ah. Oh, okay. Oh man, how do I start this? Okay, okay, let's go. Oh, I'm really gonna do 322 of these. 322 likes. What the fuck? Oh man. Oh man. Come on, no, no, I'm not a bitch. I'm not a bitch. Uh, 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 my arms. Uh, I'm not a bitch. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Oh, man. My arms. <laughs> okay. We're good. Let's go. Oh, my God. Okay, maybe I should rest. Maybe I should rest here. Okay, I'm gonna rest here. <laughs> Cause Jesus Christ. Oh man, all right. 
All right. I don't even know how many there was. <laughs> I wasn't able to keep count. Oh my God. Dude, am I really that out of shape? Am I really that out of shape, man? Like, if I ever got into like a fight or something, I'd be torn to pieces, man. Damn. This is crazy. Okay, back to, okay, we're gonna start from one again. You know, let's see if we can, uh, you know, 322 is a lot. Let's see if we can get up to like, you know, um, like fucking, I don't know, um, 30? <laughs> okay, I worked my way up to 322. Oh, my arm! My arm! <laughs> no, fuck it, fuck it! No, no, no. One, two, three, four, five, six. My phone is fucked up. <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. My dude. Yo. <laughs> Yo, this shit is crazy. My dude, my dude, this is not a joke. Oh man, how many push-ups did I even do? I wasn't even able to keep count because of the, the struggle, but I feel it though. I can't lie, man. I feel it. Oh man, look at that. Look at the, look at the striation. Look at the separation. Look at, look at, look at the feathers. <laughs> oh man, look. If you can't tell, I love the hot swings. They're a lot of my influence for doing the push-up, or rather the workout segment. But I'm taking it seriously. I need to look good for the summer. You know what? Yeah, look good for the summer. Look good for the summer, Desmond. Let's go. Let's go, Etika. One, two. Let's go, Etika. I can't do any more. I have to do more. I have to do more. I can't. I can't lift anymore. I can't. I can't do more. I can't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry guys, this is too much, this is too much, this is way more than what I expected, I need a drink, oh my god, okay, I had some water, I had some water, I'm back in the game, okay, I'm back in the game, I'm doing this, I am doing this, okay, let's go, let's go Eric. Oh god. Oh my god. I'm gonna snap my shit up. Oh shit, son. Oh. oh shit, son. Oh shit. I'll be trying to snap my shit up. My arms feel so heavy. My arms are way too heavy. I can't. Oh god. And that was the push of me. You know what? Even though I didn't get to do 322, guys, I really feel it. Like, if you look, right? I'm not even flexing right now, but look how firm the muscle is. Look at that, it's crazy. I feel it all here. I feel it here a lot. Doing this right now, my arms feel really tight. Really, really tight. I thought I was gonna snap my shit up, but no, I'm good. The arms, man, the chest. The definition. <sighs> I feel it. I feel everything. It's all here. It's just all tight. Really, really tight. Really tight. You know what? They were right. That doing this push-up challenge is good. You know, I feel good. Even though I'm worked out, I feel really good. How many push-ups did I even do? I couldn't even count. Sorry about that, guys. Next time, I'll have a lot better hold on it. But um, now, without any delay, <sighs> let's get into the next part of the bodybuilding segment. The bodybuilding meal. So let's not waste any time. Okay, so bodybuilding meal. We basically, um, from what I looked up, I need to eat a lot of you know healthier foods like um, brown rice, you know uh, broccoli, you know, proteins, a lot of proteins, things like that to help me um, stay in shape and to help get a little bit bigger as well. So um, I went to the Chinese food restaurant. <laughs> yeah, Chinese food, eating healthy, right? Isn't that hilarious? And um, went to the Chinese food restaurant. Let me just adjust this and. Got myself something that I thought was relatively healthy on the menu. A brown rice chicken and broccoli medley. So um, let's open this up and see what we're working with here. And you guys can give me like tips on, you know, just how healthy this actually is. I know it is still Chinese food at the end of the day, but it is brown rice. At the same time, it also is um, vegetables, um, broccoli. Broccoli is really good for you, I heard. So I'm um, taking a look, as you can see right here. 
the brown rice is definitely in there. Like it's, it's looking really nice right now. I mean, like brown rice I heard is extremely healthy for you, you know? Like more people should be eating brown rice in a lot of studies. So um, very interesting there. And then we're looking around here. We got us some vegetables. Most of these are really meaningless, but I heard that dark leafy greens are really good for you. So broccoli, spinach, things like that. You know, but if we move around a bit in this, we'll probably find some broccoli in here. Now, um, here we go. So we got some broccoli in there. Let me just put it up to the camera for you dudes. Like, yes, yeah, so we got some broccoli. You know, and I think it's I think it's somewhat healthy, you know? Like, it can't be that bad for you, even though it is Chinese food, but I'm thinking that there's gotta be something in this for me. You know, it's brown rice after all. I brown rice, I keep hearing so many good things about brown rice. And um, we got some carrots in here, some peppers. You know, this, does this count as a dark green? You know, this dark pepper right here? I have it with garlic sauce, so I'm not sure, you know, if that would like help or hinder the, um, the health properties of this food. But one thing that I can tell you for a fact is that when I was eating Chipotle, Chipotle actually um, filled me up pretty well because pretty much uh, Chipotle had like brown rice in it. I ordered brown rice with mine and I didn't really feel hungry until like the next day, you know? So I had that happen to me three times this week while I was eating Chipotle. So that just goes to show you when you eat good nutrients, when you eat good um, calories, it lasts longer. You don't, get, you don't get hungry as fast, you know? I think that's a really good thing. So I'm definitely going to try to eat stuff that's more up my alley. I'm not going to eat candy as much anymore because I love eating candy, if you guys don't know. And um, basically, I'll be trying to get meals more like this or more in the healthy range. You know, this isn't the healthiest thing out there, but it's a lot better than going to McDonald's and getting a double cheeseburger. Let me get some of that broccoli. Mmm. Delicious. But yeah, that's the general, that's the general bodybuilding meal that we're working with. Uh, I think it's somewhat decent, you know, it can't be too bad. But now, I also said I had something else for you guys, and I actually do. Um, we got us a little bit of a booster to help us with the protein intake, so this way I can get more of that protein without having to necessarily, you know, eat as many protein-rich foods, although I will be trying to eat protein-rich food. So um, let me go show you guys exactly what we're talking about. So as I said, I'm serious about this. And just to let you guys know how serious I am, I went out, purchased me some, um, some whey protein. Now what I learned about, oh my God, lifting this makes my arms hurt so bad. Well, they don't hurt, they're just tight. Everything's really tight. I'm losing all dexterity in my arms, man. But yeah, got us some whey protein right here. Gold standard, 100% whey. And um, from what I learned from the Hodge Twins and from what I learned at the store with this, really good for you taking this post workout really really helpful so this way you know at least you'll be able to um heal your muscles really fast put on some extra bulk really useful and that's why i figured you know even though it was expensive but then again most of these things most of these things are expensive as it is you know none of these things are cheap in fact i bought one of the most inexpensive ones in the store can you believe that some of these cost like 70 dollars 80 dollars 90 dollars how is that suitable for a college student budget, you know? So, this one specifically, this whey protein, cost about, um, about around $40, but I got it for $30 because it was on discount. So, I mean, this will be really good. I'm going to fill this up, take it with me every day. Oh, yeah, that's another thing I got to talk about. Just to let you guys know how serious I am about changing my body, too. Because remember, I'm a beginner here. You guys are beginners, too. If you are a beginner, join me on this journey, man. You know, follow what I do. I don't know. But, you know, I definitely want to be a little bit more muscular for the summer, you know? I don't want to be a twig. So, you know, this is why I feel this will be a really good expedition for me. Plus, you guys might enjoy seeing me, you know, snap my shit up. But <laughs> for the most part, yeah, this is just basically to get myself in the mode. And um, also, sorry about that. I also wanted to let you guys know how serious I am by showing you this. I'll be right back. Just to set, just to set the record straight on how serious I am. Your boy here got a membership to um, Planet Fitness. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, Planet Fitness, you know? And I heard a lot about this gym. It's not for bodybuilders, you know? It's not really, whew, it's not really made for like, you know, people that want to like put on a whole bunch of muscle because the weights don't go up that high. But I went to the one in my neighborhood. They had weights up to 400 pounds. So maybe it's just different by area, but this, the, um, the Planet Fitness by me looked really, really cool. So I signed up for a membership today. And also with the help of this whey protein, I should be seeing some nice results in due time, you know? I'm really excited about it though, you know, because I, I feel like I'm finally on that track to getting myself healthy again. And I definitely am there by eating a brown rice and broccoli melody, you know? Let's mix us up some of this shit right now. This is gonna be my water bottle. 
And basically, well, not my water bottle, but my protein shake bottle. I'll take this with me to the gym every day. It's basically a bottle I bought from the store, but I didn't have the money to buy like a, you know, a big expensive canister. So you know what, whatever, it does the job. I'm gonna open this up, put some of this, um, put some of this whey protein in here. Get me some gains, you know? Uh, yeah. So let's let's go down here. All right then. So um, I'll put some of this whey protein in here. I um, since the opening is a little bit small, I got myself a little plastic cup to be able to pour it in easier, you know. And uh, yeah, this table's a little small. I got to get a bigger table. Jesus Christ. Yeah, my little studio apartment. We're gonna set this up. All right then. So. I'm hoping, like, you know, maybe by two months I'll see some kind of difference. I plan on going to Planet Fitness uh, every day, early in the morning, to make sure that, you know, I don't run into too many people, you know, because even when I went to the Planet Fitness, it was, um, it still had a whole lot of people in it. And, you know, I don't want to look like I'm a bitch, so, you know, I don't want to... <laughs> I'm just kidding, you know, I don't really, I'm not really concerned about how other people perceive me in the gym. Because, you know, we're all there to work out at the end of the day. So, it's all good. So now I'm gonna pour some of this in here. Also, this says that it has about um, 24 grams of protein and it has about uh, 29 servings. So 24 grams of per protein per serving. So with two servings of this, two scoops is a, wait, one scoop is a serving. So I'm gonna probably um, put two scoops of this every day for my uh, post-workout. So that'll be about, um, about uh, 40, 48 grams of protein being taken with every single one of these that I fill since I'm putting two scoops in. So let me put that next scoop. Should I be doing more? Let me know. Let me know if I should be doing more because I'll definitely do more if I should be. But I'm gonna be taking this every day, you know? Maybe for the days that I'm resting, one scoop. But for the days that I work, definitely two scoops. I wish I had the money to get the more expensive brand that had higher protein count in it, but it's all good, you know? I think this will still do the job as long as I'm working out. It smells good too, it's vanilla flavored. It sounds really nice, so. Anyways, let's do this. Hopefully I don't make a fucking mess. Jesus Christ, man. Okay. God damn it. I should have gotten an easier canton for this because how am I gonna pour this in here without making a mess? It's all solid and shit. Okay, come on. No mess. No mess. No mess. Oh my God, it's spilling everywhere. That's what she said. <laughs> Jesus. Well, you know, at least I'm getting most of it in there. These are the days of a broke, you know, Young adult, man, like, we gotta make shit work. Jesus, I'm spilling it everywhere! <laughs> Come on, man! 